And then right here is the handcuff key that he has hidden in his sock. Well. You're looking at one of two body scanners installed in the Racine County Jail this year to stop inmates from smuggling in everything from illegal drugs to weapons. People go to great lengths today to hide things on their person. Sheriff Christopher Smaling says he installed the x-ray machines in part after a known heroin user nearly died overdosing in her cell even after she'd been thoroughly searched. Within minutes she removed a syringe uh, loaded with heroin uh, from a body cavity uh, and, and injected herself with that. You could see it throughout the neck and into the lower intestine area. The scanners cost nearly $120,000 each. The sheriff said they were paid for with funds from the inmate store and could save the county millions in a potential wrongful death lawsuit. Genitalia and breasts are not revealed, but an officer recently used the body scanner to discover crack cocaine inside an inmate. Was it ingested or just hidden intentionally? It was, it was inside the container that would normally have breath mints, uh, had bindles of crack cocaine inside that container, and that container was then put inside uh, a body cavity. Jail officials say more inmates are voluntarily surrendering drugs and weapons now that they know they're going to be searched with a body scanner. If hidden objects are found, an inmate is transferred to a hospital for a doctor to remove. In Racine County, Terry Sater, WISN 12 News. And the sheriff says while the scanners use x-ray technology, they expose inmates to tiny amounts of radiation. Inmates are also screened for potential health risks. And the Milwaukee County Sheriff just acquired a body scanner from the House of Correction. It should be up and running in the next two months.